Hello humans, I'm Yo Schiller. Welcome back to some more Animal Crossing New Horizons. This is a video series in which I'm going to play this game for an hour every single day. It is 7.30 on March 21st, which is a Saturday, and I'm going to see what is going to happen today, because I really don't know. I only played the game for an hour yesterday. I'm going to play the game for an hour today, and we're going to see how much I can get done in an hour's time. Should be fun. I also got a fishing pole. I got a new place to live. I got two residents with me. I hung out with the Nookster. He was pretty cool. I got a picture with him and one of his kids. So here we are, 7.30 a.m. Animal Crossing New Horizons menu screen. Ooh, what are the settings? What can I change? Or is it just changing my character's gender or something like that? Something like I can already do in the game. Oh, hey, what's up? Hello, Yoshiller. This is where I take on an important request related to settings. The requests I accept here are very serious ones, so children should get help from a parent or a guardian. Oh, now what settings would you like to talk about today? Hmm, nothing right now. Yes, yes, I understand. In that case, let's return you to the title screen. I hope you continue to enjoy life on Aquanet. Tell you what, I won't count that toward the hour of gameplay that I plan to, well, play in this game today. I just wanted to know what that setting was, but I guess that's settings if you want to reset your island and delete your save data, because Nookster made it sound like it was very serious, so I don't want to mess with that. Oh yeah, and the big thing, my island has pears on it. I'm not a big fan of pears. They are green, and I guess I am associated with the color green quite often, so that much is nice. But a lot of people out there were saying, well, I'll trade your fruit, and don't worry, I'll trade fruit in the future, but for these first couple of days... Oh. Oh dear, so sorry about that. The volume was a little loud there. For the first couple of days, I want to play by myself. I want to see how I can grow the island without the assistance of other players. And then after maybe three or four days, I will explore plenty of other islands and trade fruit and supplies and all that. But for these first couple of days, I want to grow my island by myself. Thank you all for your generosity. I will deal with the pears for the time being. Anyway, hello everyone. Starting today, I'll be doing an island-wide broadcast full of this island updates, goings-on, and such. Hmm? I'll go over some things that are very important to island life, so lend me your island ears for a short time. Now, it's only fitting that we kick off this daily ritual with a doozy of an island announcement. The Aquanet Airport is now open for business. Starting today, you can use online or local communication to fly to other islands for a visit. I will not be doing that today, but I will be doing that in due time. That's not all! No, no, the airport counter now offers postal services. And just like the resident services center, the airport is open 24 hours a day, so please do drop by for a look. That's all for me. Time for you all to get out and enjoy your day. Yes, yes. Thank you, Nookster. Okay. Well, I don't know what's going to happen today. I don't really go into these videos with plans because I don't really know how Animal Crossing works. I guess I could go fishing. I got a fishing pole. There we go. I got a hat. Very nice. Okay. Well, it's morning time. Let's get some pears, huh? I live next to a pear tree. Better get used to the pears. Alright, so what do you say the first thing we do then? Is we go fishing. I have to look for a dot. And then I have to cast my line and try and catch the dot, right? But I don't see any dots. Does the dot not show up until I actually take out the fishing pole? Or the fishing, fishing rod? I don't know. Let me hold it. See if that changes anything. No, no. Maybe all the fish are still are asleep. Maybe it's too early. Oh, ooh, whoa, 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 whoa. What's the deal with this? Hello? You want to explain yourself to whoever fishes this out of the surf? Bet you weren't expecting to find a DIY recipe washed up in a bottle. Keep an open mind. And as I always say, this crafting project is something to help you reflect. Build it. And you'll see what I'm getting at. Wishing you luck, Gonzo. Got a DIY recipe. Oh, hey, a wooden table mirror? Hmm. I guess I'll go ahead and decorate my house a little later. Right now, I want to do some morning fishing. There's a fish. So you just press A to cast the line. And then you wait for the fish to come to you. And then you press A to bring it back in, I guess, when the time is ready. Oh, I cast in too quickly. I messed up. I'm sorry. I lost... My first fishing experience in this game. Oh no, wait, no, I want, I want to... How do I take you with me? Hmm. Uh, use the net? Oh, no, I can't do anything in this game properly. 
<laughs> and what's this? What is this? I don't have a shovel yet. <laughs> Alright, I, I guess I'll come back to that later. I don't know what that's all about. I, I could catch this bug, but I really wanted to go fishing. But alright, I'll take a bug. Yes! I caught a common butterfly. They often flutter by. Well, at least the text boxes have a sense of humor with its rhyming. Okay. We got more pears. I'll take the pears, thanks. Thanks. Thank you, pear. Thank oh, no, I guess I'll take that too. Okay, and I guess I'll take this. And this. And this one. But I really, really just want to go fishing. Here. Do I have to catch you in the net? You're not a... You're a crustacean. You're not a bug. Okay, I guess I can catch you in the net. Yes! I caught a hermit crab. I think it wanted to be left alone. Well, I, I got it now. And the other one's gone. Okay, but are there any more dots in the ocean? Here. Take that. Oh, wait. Come back! Got it. Okay, same deal. I caught a hermit crab. I think it wanted to be left alone. Probably. Sorry. This wouldn't be happening if there were just more fish in the ocean. Okay. That's our problem with this island. There's no fish in the ocean. How's anyone supposed to enjoy fishing when there's... Oh, hey, 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 wait, 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 wait. This seems like a nice big fish. Guys, you don't understand. I don't really go fishing in real life, but I love the big fish. Am I supposed to mash A? That's what I'm doing. I'm mashing A. Hey, I got it. I got a nice big fish. Yes! I caught a sea bass. No, wait. It's at least a C plus. Love it. Thanks. I want to do a little more fishing. Considering I'm surrounded by water right now. Let's go a little more up the stream, hmm? And let's get a few more pears. Let's get all the pears. Alright, because I think these grow back every day, right? So I'm encouraged to just get the pears. So thank you. I will take these. And then we'll look at my Nook Miles and we'll sell some stuff and see what types of quests I can accomplish today. Alright. Taking all those. Putting all that away. Very good. And we'll shake that one too for good luck. Alright. No good luck. We're, we're out of luck. Alright. Can I get that fish all the way up there? No. No, I... No, I can't. <laughs> just... Just want my fish. Alright. I'll get this bug then. I'll go back and shake trees and I'll... There we go. We're good. Common butterfly. Yep, yep, yep. But I want to be fishing! It's the fish that I want! That's protein! <sighs> I'm trying to do a, a normal activity. Oh. I'm trying to do... Oh, hey. Do basic activities in this game. The game won't let me. The game's like, no, you have to... You gotta be catching bugs. And I'm like, no, I want to be catching fish, darn it. Right here. Let's go. Too far away? Too far away. Let's get closer. No! No, come back! Please. Be interested in my rod. No! <laughs> Ugh. Guys, I'm not enjoying the island experience. Please. Come to me. No, I don't understand how fishing works! <sighs> I don't understand. Just, I want more fish. I want more fish. I don't want more pears necessarily, but I'm taking them anyway. Guys, I've already spent eight minutes. Hey, how do you, how do, you do it? Hey, Mac. Check me out! I'm gonna catch the biggest, baddest fish on the island! Woof! -woof. Let me know how you do that. Because I also want to catch the biggest, baddest fish on the island. I only caught one. It was like a generic trout. And now I'm about to go full circle. Alright, let's try this again. Get the fish. I don't normally fish in real life. Okay, 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 okay. I, get this. Oh, I think this one's smaller than the other fish I caught. Yes! I caught a horse mackerel. Of course, mackerel. Ah, more rhyming. Anyway, I don't fish in real life. But I do love aquatic animals. I think they're neat. I just want to collect the aquatic animals, darn it. You want this? Do I need to cast it again? Because I'll do it. Don't tempt me. I'll cast it again. Here. Ready? 
There you go. Yeah, yes, yes, yes. Patience. Patience. Can't press anything to make it get closer to you. I just have to hope that you want it. All right, I'll cast it one more time. This is as close as it's going to get. Boom. It's right next to you. Come on. Work with, work with me. Is it out of your line of sight? Is that how this works? All right, all right, all right, all right. Step a little back. Let's, let's, let's go. Right there. That's in your line of sight. It should be. Well, how do you, how do you work, fish? Please. I just want to catch you. I just want to be fishing. I'd rather be fishing. Come on. Can't. I'll let it sit for a minute, I guess. Fishing's all about patience, right? But I don't have that kind of time. I only have an hour. I can't spend much longer. That's good. That's great. Come on. How does fishing work? <laughs> I'm doing the same thing with each fish, and sometimes it works, and sometimes it doesn't. I spent all that time, and I didn't even get the... I don't think I like fishing. <laughs> I don't know if it's a matter of needing to be too patient or what. I don't see. I don't get it. Am I supposed to mash or hold the button down? Cause I've been mashing and that worked on the previous ones. Cause what? What is going on? I thought I just saw like smoke. Yeah, I don't. I wanted. What? And then what is this? I don't know. I don't know what's going on with this island. I can't catch any fish. I'm only catching butterfly bugs. I'm so sorry, guys. See, see this. this? There was like a dot there. I don't know what that is. I just want to catch fish. That's what I want to do today. Got up early. Wanted to go fishing. Alright, I guess that's what I have to wait for. I have to wait for like a vibration in my controller. There. I'm going to keep going until I... I can't carry anything else? Oh, that doesn't count as like a... Plus two. Alright, uh... I guess I am not going to be fishing for a little bit. What don't I need? I guess I can come back for the... Oh, yeah, I definitely don't need that many pairs. Alright, let's go sell some stuff. Although this butterfly looks different than the other butterflies. I'm going to catch this real quick, and if it is a generic butterfly, I will let it go. Where'd it go? Oh, there it is. Got it. Yeah, this is a bigger butterfly. Yes! I caught a tiger butterfly. I've earned my stripes. But I can't carry anything else. Alright. We'll swap it. <sighs> Tree branches. Tree branches. Okay. Hey, Nookster, I think I have some stuff to sell you. And I hope that my stuff is still sitting on the floor when I come back outside your shop. In fact, what's, what's, your, what's your vibe? Oh, you Schiller! It's good to see you! How are you enjoying this island life? I don't know. I'm not very good at fishing. I only have so much inventory. I saw a message bottle wash up on the beach here. Of all the beaches in the world, right? There is mystery and adventure when someone sends a note by bottle out into the big blue ocean. I picked it up at first, but then I put it back down so someone else can enjoy opening it. Well, that's nice of you. I did find it. Alright, Nookster. You awake? What's your deal? <sighs> Nookster, I just wanted to go fishing. I tried using the fishing rod. Oh, yeah, you've got a, got a nice drink here. Well, before I chat with you, Nookster, let me chat with your kid. Welcome, Yo Schiller. How can I help you today? I would like to sell stuff, and then I will soon see what else is for sale. Okay. So I'll, I'll sell these pears. I guess I could sell everything at once, huh? So, all right, some pears. Sure. How about if I offer you a thousand? Bell? Yeah, man. It's a lot more than I was expecting. So it's about a hundred bells a pair. That's good. Okay. I still want to sell though. Not done just yet. All right. Sell those. I have two horse mackerels. Two hermit crabs. Anything else I want to sell? Two flimsy fishing rods. But. 
I will hang on to two flimsy fishing rods. And I guess I could always get another giant clam, right? So let's do that. Look at all the fine things you've brought in today. Allow me to just a moment to run the numbers. And done! I can buy these things from you for a total of 3,050 bells. Sound good? Sounds great. Okay. Now what other random items can I buy? What's for sale? Okay. Ooh. Toolbox, yes. Please. I will gladly take that. And you know what? I'll take the canister too. But I want to see what else you have. Real quick. Before I settle on using the rest of my bells for the canister. Let's see. Flimsy net. Flimsy fishing rod. So these are flowers. I could make flower paths. Sounds nice. Sapling. See it out, but I'm not buying a pear. Okay. Medicine. I don't think I need that just yet. Don't need the watering can unless I'm gonna do some gardening, which I will I don't think I'm gonna be doing today. So we'll get the plastic canister. Okay? I'll buy it. Thank you. So here's what I'm gonna do now. I'm gonna look. Oh. I'm gonna look up my Nook phone. We're gonna see what achievements I guess I did. All right, let's see, let's see, let's see. There you go, pick up the bunch. You'll get Nook miles based on the amount of fruit you've sold, great. So I get the next one when I've picked 100 fruit. Very good. Okay, back. Oh. Cast master, yeah. Cast your line carefully if you want to reel in this reward. You'll need to nab a bunch of fish in a row without a single one getting away. I haven't even gotten one yet. Oh, wait, and then what's this? Put more furniture in your house. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. But is that it for now? Is that all I can all I can claim? Oh. To illustrate this, I'll award you some Nook Miles based on the number of active days you've spent here. Okay, so you keep playing the game. You get more Nook Miles. That sounds like Animal Crossing. Let's go ahead and check out this machine real quick. Oh, how could I forget? Hmm? I should give you a brief explanation about that terminal. That is our Nook Stop. It's a terminal for services that will further enhance your island life. At the moment, you can use two services, Yoshiller. The first is Nook Shopping. It's a catalog shopping service for items that can be hard to find on an island. Second, this terminal serves as an automatic bell dispenser, or ABD, for the Bank of Nook. We're also working on a service by which you'll be able to redeem Nook Miles for various things. Please take advantage of these wonderful services. Quite beneficial indeed. Yes, yes. All right. Welcome to Nook Stop, a multimedia terminal from Nook Inc. Once per day, accessing the Nook Stop will award you bonus daily miles. Oh, I should have done this yesterday. Messed up. Okay. Well, let's see what the Nook Shopping catalog has to offer. Oh, hey, yeah, these are hard to find items, huh? Well, I could get an outdoor table. But I don't think I get to, like, ride the bike, right? I'm pretty sure that's just for decoration. So, hmm, sweatpants sound nice. I'll buy those. Thank you. And then music. I don't think I need that necessarily. I got the sweatpants. Those are on the way. That's it for now. Okay. And then let's check out the ABD. Hmm... Well, in that case, I shall deposit the remainder of my bells for now. Oh, full amount. Confirm. Hmm. Okay. How do I start paying off the loan then? All right, please select from the following services. I want to put money toward that. Hey, man. Ah, yo, Schiller, hello, hello. What would you like to talk to me about? I'm all ears. Okay, well, if you're willing. About my moving fees. Oh, you'd like to pay your moving fees? Well, you owe me 5,000 miles. Let's talk when you've had a chance. Oh, okay. But there's no need to rush. No, no. Enjoy your island life and save up those miles. You're a good guy, Nookster. I like you. And then this beeped. Did I get more miles? What did I do? Hmm. <laughs> there it is. Living on a remote island doesn't mean you have to go without life's luxuries. Shop to your heart's content with Nook Shopping and you'll earn Nook Miles. Okay. Cool. I'll take him. All right. All right, all right, all right. Bell ringer. Spending your bells. Okay. So I've almost spent 5,000 bells. So maybe I should just take my bells out. Okay, so this, this is a bank. 
I don't need to put my bells in here. Alright, I'm taking my bells back out. I don't, I don't need... I don't need those just yet. Or, rather, I do need them because I need to spend them right now. Okay. Thank you. And then I think the only other thing in here that I haven't interacted with is this. Oh, I should give you a brief introduction to that box, too. That is a recycle box for all of the island residents to use. We'll be using it for items removed during construction and such. Yes, yes, if you see anything you like, feel free to take it right on home. If the box gets full, we'll get rid of the oldest items first, so don't delay in picking out what you want. Okay. Ooh, 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 ooh. Well, I'll take the cardboard box. Thank you. All right. Goodbye. Okay. Also, I never sold the weeds, did I? Nope, I guess I'm not done with this store just yet. I don't want to spend too much time in the store every day. I'll find a better way to optimize this, but as it stands, I need to go back in the store and sell some more stuff. So here we go. Welcome, you chiller. How can I help you today? I want to sell. Of course. What exactly are you offering? Okay. Clumps of weeds. You, you can have those. There you go. I was told you'll buy them. Some clumps of weed. Sure, how... 600 bills. Yeah, that's so those are worth nothing, but I don't blame them for being worth nothing. Okay. And then... What, I got more Nook Miles for selling stuff? Yeah, I get... Oh, for... Yeah. Cool. Very good. Cool. Alright. And then... I need... Maybe I need to buy one more thing from you. So, what's for sale? I already bought the toolbox. I already bought... I guess I'll buy the watering can. Or the, uh, the slingshot? What's more useful, the watering can or the slingshot? Because I'm not gardening today. So I don't think I need... DIY for beginners. Okay, I guess I'll buy that. Let's see. It's 480 bells, what do you think? I guess... Yeah, what is this? It contains simple DIY recipes and materials that you can easily obtain. I'll send the recipe data to your app immediately if you decide to make a purchase. Let's see. Alright. I guess I'll buy it. Excellent purchase. Yes, thank you for the 480 bells. Okay, it's time to send recipes from DIY for Beginners to your phone. Okay. Neat. In that case, and we're done. I hope you enjoy DIY even more now with your new recipes. Anything else look interesting? Well, I guess in that case, I'll get the slingshot recipe. Alright. I'll buy it. Cool. And then, yeah, the amount of stuff I can actually buy is going to be limited for a few days. Okay. Good. And then what's your deal? Do you have any more DIY things you want me to make? Hello, hello. What would you like to talk to me about? Well, Nookster. Yeah, yeah, I found a creature. Oh, splendid! Let's have a look, shall we? Now, how about you look at the tiger butterfly? Oh, what a catch! I do believe this is a tiger butterfly. Hmm, if this island can support a tiger butterfly... Why, who knows what other fantastic creatures we might find living here? Yo, Schiller, I have an idea. An old friend of mine runs a museum, and I'd love to send it, and send it to him for a closer look. Would you be okay with that? Absolutely. Thank you. I promise that I'll take extra good care of your tiger butterfly. Oh! That reminds me. This is no way tied to your generous donation just now, but I have a, a useful app to show you. Ooh. Aw, yeah, Critterpedia. I sent you the Critterpedia app. It's a terrific resource for an aspiring island researcher such as yourself. With this one app, you'll get all the important details about the bugs and fish you catch. Yes, yes. I do hope you'll continue to fill it up with your discoveries and share them with me, too. I'm sure I'll be able to come up with some kind of additional reward, hmm? Alright. In that case, what if I show you the fish? Do you have a friend who knows about the fish? Found a creature? Oh, another creature? Well, let's have a look at that one as well. Alright. Big fish. There you go. Oh, what a catch! I do believe this is a sea bass. Would you mind if I sent this to a magnificent? If, would you mind if I sent this magnificent creature along to my museum curating friend as well? Okay. Thank you. I promise that I'll take extra good care of your sea bass. Oh, by the way, have you been taking advantage of my DIY workbench lately? Hmm. I guess I made the one item, so yeah. 
Is that so? Well, I suppose I haven't been paying much attention. That reminds me. I've been meaning to share more DIY recipes with you. Mind turning on your phone? Yes. Yes, I love it. I love it so much. There we go. I just sent you a number of DIY recipes that require wood, along with the recipe to craft an axe. Yes, yes, I think an axe would come in quite useful on this island, because so many other things are made of wood, hmm? I hope you'll keep bringing me new discoveries to examine. It's all a part of the island experience, yes, yes. Great. So, we got more Nook Miles, it seems. There we go. So, I'm just forgetting the DIY recipes. I get Nook Miles. Great. It's awesome, actually. And then... There we go, Nook Phone Life. Gotten used to your Nook phone? The fact that you're reading this probably means you have. Keep using it and enjoy some Nook Miles for just for getting familiar with it. Wonderful. Okay. Almost at 5,000, guys. Maybe I'll get to it today. Maybe. Okay, well, that'll do it for now. I think I've done everything I possibly need to do in this shop for today. So let's go back outside. Let's do a little more fishing. In fact, let's drop some stuff off at my place. Let's drop off some furniture so I have some more. Oh, hang on, what are you carrying? Yo, Urg, what's the word? I wanna chat. I kinda moved here on a whim, and I'm not sure I brought enough bells with me, Urg. Like, you hear deserted island and you think you're not even gonna need money. Yeah, I need a plan. Hmm. I heard I can get Bell selling fruits and weeds and stuff to Timmy. If I do that, maybe I'll be all right. You're right. You are, you are correct. You will be all right. Hey, hello. This is another generic butterfly, right? Yeah. Okay, I'll give that to Tom Nook in a little bit. For now, I'm gonna shake this tree. Nope, all right. So let's go inside. Let's see what furniture I can drop off. And we'll see what else I plan to collect today. Hmm. You know, now that I think about it, this place isn't as spacious as I was hoping, but we'll make it work. Rock guitar? Sure, why not? So, boom. Guess that, that'll go there. Cool. Let's push that into this corner. And then in this corner right here, that's where I'll put this nice cardboard box, yes? There you go. What? You can't put anything there? Mmm. <sighs> okay, what if this actually goes all the way into the corner and the cardboard box goes next to it? Yes! Oh, it's bigger than I thought. Okay, maybe you'll just have to go there then. Alright, we're good. And then I'll go outside and put the toolkit outside and so I can start crafting stuff right next to my house. It's great! All right, so boom, we'll have, we'll put this away for now. And then I need, we'll put the toolbox on this side. Okay, so boom. Yeah, I guess that's it. Oh, hang on, I got mail. I can barely even see the mail alert with this tree in the way. Maybe, maybe I really do just need an ax so I can cut down this tree. All right, oh, from Nintendo. Thank you for downloading the update. We'd like to give you a present to show our appreciation. Please keep an eye out for future updates as well. Okay, what's the present? What do we got? Oh, all right. And then we got a present from Mom. From Mom, my dear Yo Schiller, how is your new life treating you? Are you eating well, brushing your teeth, washing behind your ears? Oh dear, I'm all worked up. Here's a little something to help out. Eat it or plant it, but thinking of me, well, plant it? Hmm. Okay. And then another Nintendo one. Congratulations on your big move. We hope you enjoy your new island life. To celebrate this fresh start, we'd like to give you a gift that is sure to come in handy. All right. All right, all right, hang on. Okay, before I open the presents, toolbox goes there. And then I thought I had like a crafting table. No? I just bought a toolkit. Okay, so. It's just a toolkit. Well. Put that away. We'll put that inside, huh? Ah, uh, no, no. We'll leave it outside. Place item. We got a plastic canister. I'll put my toolkit here, and then we'll see what the gifts are. So, boom, place item. All right. So those were just for decoration. I thought they were actually going to be useful, but that is okay. Right there. 
Cool. Right on the corner where it could easily fall into the water. And then I'll pick that up. All right, let's see what the gifts are. So, boom. Open. A Nintendo Switch? Really? Huh. So be it. I guess I'll put that inside. We'll go ahead and put that here. Although, I kind of wish the Joy-Con colors matched my actual Joy-Cons because, as you might be able to see, if I do this correctly, my current Joy-Cons are green and pink. I don't know why they're blue and red here, but that's okay. That's okay. So we'll we'll go ahead then, trying to interact with the radio. Slide that over. Hmm. How uh, how far can I actually slide this over? Like there. Okay, and I'm trying to get on the bed. Darn it. Okay. Here. I can't. I can't. I can't get on the bed this way. This will not work. Alright. What I actually kind of want to do then. Oh my goodness. I'm ruining everything. Can I not get off in the north? I can. Okay. Go. Go over there. And then where I put the Nintendo Switch down, I want to be able to push it to the right. All I want to do. Okay, I'll put the radio back afterward. This can go all the way in that corner by the bedside. Good. And then the radio can go right back here where it was. Much better. Now what was the next gift? Let's open it outside. I think that's more fun. I am playing this game in the morning. We should show the great morning light. Okay. Next gift. Open. Cherries! 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 Decent enough fruit, I suppose. That must be the gift from my mom. She told me to plant them. I can do that, hmm? Alright. And the simple DIY... A workbench? Yeah, how do I learn this? Huh, okay. Sweet! I learned a DIY recipe for a simple DIY workbench. Oh, I guess that's all it is, and I have to look at the app. Alright, cherries, huh? I can make a cherry tree. Look, cherries and pears are not my ideal trees, but I'll gladly take the cherries over the pears. So just so I can keep track of this tree, I guess I'll put the cherry tree right here. So I can just uh, drop item, I guess. Maybe I can't bury these yet. Okay, I guess we'll deal with the fruit another day. But the, the, the workbench. Okay, well first let's get the Nook Miles, and then I want to make the workbench. That's what I thought the toolbox was going to be used for. Okay, hoard reward. Put more furniture in your house. Yep, I'll take that. Thank you. Great. All right. And then... Is that it? Nothing for opening gifts? All right. Let's have a look then at the DIY recipes. Next. Close. Okay. Yes. I need hardwood and an iron nugget. Hmm. I guess I need to make an axe if I want to get the iron nugget. Not sure. I need clay, tree branch. Hmm. Okay, well, let's just interact with stuff. See what I can get. I don't have an axe yet. So, maybe I should... Maybe I, that's what I can make at the Nookster's shop. Let me see. Let me see, let me see, let me see. All right, let me look at this. Should I craft something using Tom Nook's work workbench? Yes, I should. You said I can make an axe. Yes, that's exactly what I need. I need a flimsy axe. I need tree branches and stone. Easy, 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 easy. I will go ahead and craft these things real quickly. As well as be on the lookout for any fish that might appear along the way. So I need tree branches and I need stone. So I can just take that. Yeah, I'm pressing A next to this. I guess that doesn't do anything. That's fine. That's fine. Got the tree branch. Hey, do you have any... Can I come in? Do you have any tree branches or stones? Looks like no one's here. Well, I guess I'm not going inside then. Okay. Shake all the trees. Shake all the trees. 
Don't get stung by bees. Hope for the best. Prepare for the worst. Okay. It just... It just... I don't really know if today has been as productive as I was hoping it would be. I'll take 100 bells, thanks. See, that kid just saw me take 100 bells out of a tree. Money does grow on trees in this game. Oh no, I don't want to deal with this right now. Oh my god! <laughs> hmm. All I wanted to do was go fishing. All I wanted to do today. Give me that. Alright. Instead, I got stung by friggin' bees. I'll take these, though. Thank you. Oh, there's a big fish! Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Let me get the fishing rod out. Okay. Big fish. Please. Please. Ah. I don't get it. No, wait. Turn back around. I had it! I had it! Ugh. Here I am, stung by wasps. Can't get this fish. Please bite onto the line. Please. Okay, I'll cast it again. At a slightly better angle, hopefully. Good? That's right in front of you. I'm gonna wait for you to bite on. Yes! Yes! Give me the big fish! Yes! Love it! Yes! I caught a yellow perch. These yellow birds have to sit somewhere. Love it. Thank you. Alright, well, what do you say we take a momentous picture to celebrate the day? Also, I'll take that real quick. Okay, and then, yeah, th this was blowing steam. What was that? What was that? Alright, well, let's, let's take a picture, huh? To celebrate the day. So I need the Nook phone. I need the camera. I wish I could be like holding a fish or something, but it's okay. Uh, maybe I can. Maybe I can. I hope this fish doesn't like flop away. Show it off. Okay. That's it, huh? Hmm. But I want to take a picture with the Nook phone while I do it. It's fine. It's, let's get the Nook phone out. Boom. Yeah, I can't, I can't get an item out while I do it. Well, bit of a bummer if I do say so myself. I guess I could show myself like pretending to fish. No, I can't. If I press A, it doesn't do anything. Ugh. Well, then we're just going to have the Nook phone follow me, I guess. No, I'm not. I, I thought I was going to try and take a photo with the Nook phone every day, but alas, not as I hoped. Well, then what do you say we take a picture with the butterfly? I caught bugs today, too. Oh, no, the, no, no, the butterfly's there. Wait. Wait, butterfly, wait. Can't do anything. <laughs> butterfly, you need to stay in the shot. All right, fine, we'll go to the, we'll go to the... Go to the silhouette of this fish, and we'll take a picture that way, huh? That's probably more accurate to today. Darn it! Darn it, I was blinking! Darn it! Dude! Let's try again. Alright? I don't want to redo Nook photos, but that was honestly a terrible photo. So let's try again. Alright? That's a little better. We'll, we'll work with that. Now let's try and fish this one out and hope for the best. Okay. Take it back. Bring it back. All right. There you go. Let's try again. Right in front of you. Wait for it to bite. Wait for the controller to vibrate. And then press A. There we go. See, now I think I'm getting the hang of it. Is this a new one? Yes. I caught a black bass. The most metal of all fish. But I can't carry anything else. Should I swap? It? Yes, I will swap it with something. Surely there's something I don't need. Yeah, the clump of weeds. I don't need that. Get that out of here. All right. Cool. I got more fish. Hey, Nookster. How's your buddy with the with the fish doing? I would like to give you another fish. Okay. 
I've been fishing, Nook. I've been fishing. Here we go. Ah, yo, Schiller, hello, hello! What would you like to talk to me about? I'm all ears. I found a creature. Oh, splendid, let's have a look, shall we? I got the black bass. There you go. Oh, what a catch! I do believe this is a black bass. Would you mind if I sent this to my magnificent creature to my museum curating friend as well? By all means. Thank you, I promise that I'll take extra good care of your black bass. By the way, I have a proper reward for you this time. Ooh! I can't see what it is. I've given you a red pansy bag. Just a little sampling of a product we sell. Go ahead and do some planting after a few days. You'll have beautiful blooming, blooming flowers. Anyway, give it a whirl, and if you enjoy gardening, stop by and buy more. Well, I'm not gonna garden today. It's all part of the island experience, yes, yes. Good. Now I have to go back to finding rocks and sticks <laughs> and fish. That's what I'm doing today. Oh, I'm stretching, thank goodness my Joy-Cons can be played wirelessly. I get the idea behind this game is to relax and just kind of make up what you want to do. Figure out what you want to do as time goes along. So I hope that my commentary has been entertaining or calming, if not both. I am trying to make a video that is worth watching or at least having on in the background as you do your everyday activities. I don't know how people plan to watch these videos. Oh, no, no, I don't, I don't, I don't need that bag of weed. I don't need that. Drop it. Thank you. But maybe it'd be fun to spice this video up a bit by providing a personal anecdote from my life. So how about I tell you a little story? How about that? Okay. Let me sell the stuff and then I can focus on telling the story while I explore the rest of the island searching for things. All right, Yo Schiller, hello, hello. Okay, I'm all ears. Found a creature. Okay, there we go. I can give you the hermit crab, huh? And I'll give that to you. Oh, what a catch! I do believe this is a hermit crab. Would you mind if I send this magnificent creature along to my museum curating friend as well? Yes, A-OK -okay with that. Thank you, I promise that I'll take extra good care of your hermit crab. Yeah, you have a lot of stuff. Oh, remember the flower samples I gave you? I forgot to mention something. The flowers that grow will be very strong. They'll spring up even if you just plant them and forget them. Ah, but if you water them each day, that's where the magic happens. Watering opens up the possibility of pro propagating and crossbreeding your flowers to develop rare colors. Well, I don't know if I want to deal with that today. I've only got about 15 minutes left. And how might you water them, you ask? With a watering can? Well, I've just sent you a DIY recipe for a watering can. My accountant warned me about giving this sort of thing away for free. But you've collected cre enough creatures for me, Yo Schiller, so this is just part of the island give and take. I hope you'll keep bringing me new discoveries to examine. It's all part of the island experience. Yes, yes. Alright, well then I'll keep giving you stuff. Alright, I found a creature. Another creature? Well, let's have a look at this one as well. Alright, this is a common butterfly. There you go. Oh, what a catch! I do believe this is a common butterfly. Would you mind if I sent this magnificent creature to my museum curating friend? Yes. Yes, you can take it. Okay, good. Oh, hold the phone, someone's calling. Blathers, is that you? Oh ho, what splendid timing. Yes, yes, do you remember the venture we discussed? Well, it's come to fruition. I am currently stationed on an island that we've decided to call Aquanet. Yes, yes, the local fauna are as abundant as I expected, just as I told you. Mm-hmm. How many precisely, you ask? Well, there's no way of knowing just yet. But I have received, let's see. Five outstanding specimens so far. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, what, seriously? Well, that is very exciting. Oh, but you'll have to excuse me, I'm with a customer right now. I'm so sorry to keep you waiting. That was my friend Blathers, the one who curates a museum. Believe it or not, he's going to come to our island to help us identify and preserve the local creatures. That's exciting, I love it. Ah, oh, but I could use your help, Yoshiller. Oh, I get to determine where it goes, right? Since you've done so much scouting and collecting already, would you be able to help me find a spot for Blathers? We'll need a good sized space to really build out a world class museum, so do keep that in mind. This is exciting, it's all coming together, yes, yes. And then you, I wanna sell the other butterfly to you real quickly. All right, so this story. So I was a good kid in high school. I took my honors and AP classes, whoops, I selected buy not sell. I was a good kid in high school. I took my honors and AP classes, I got good grades, A's and B's, but there was one time I was sent to the principal's office. 
And it was because I was in trouble, not just to deliver something to the principal. You see, I used to be a cartoonist for the school newspaper. And during that time, I was only able to draw in what was basically pen and ink. I could only use two colors, black and white. And so if I needed to shade something, I would usually color something entirely in black. It wasn't a fantastic cartoonist. I was I had a very basic style, but my illustrations got the job done. And I would often make like two, three panel comics as we saw fit. Do I have any of these comics lying around? I don't think I do, but I think they've been stored digitally and they're not super funny, so you're not missing much. But anyway, there was a time when my high school got in a fight with another high school. Still don't know what this glowing light is, but whatever. And this fight took place due to like a football game. So, to help differentiate the players in the illustration, I drew one team having white faces with black jerseys and another team having black faces with white jerseys. I thought that was the best way to distinguish something in a pen and ink drawing at the time, and you probably see where this is going. Well, I did get in trouble for what was believed to be a, an offensive drawing. I did not know it was offensive at the time. I just drew it. We approved it. We sent out the papers. And then let me, let me imagine this. So we sent out the newspapers. We printed hundreds of copies. They went around. I guess some other schools read our papers as well. So I never took that into consideration. But what wound up happening was there was one day where I was out and about doing interviews or helping someone do interviews or something. And I actually got a phone call from my teacher. My teacher had to call me on the phone and tell me to go to the principal's office. So she said, you have to go to the principal's office now. So I walked myself to the principal's office. I get to the principal's office. You know, there's a lady working the front desk and she says, hi, are you Bradley? And I say, I am. She goes, okay, just sit in the principal's office. The principal will be here in just a moment. I say, okay. So I sit down, I sit there for a good minute or two. Principal walks in and goes, hey, are you Bradley? And I say, I am. And he's super relaxed. I'm kind of relaxed too, because I don't really know what's to be expected. I don't know. I don't, I don't, I don't know why I'm in the principal's office. I don't, <laughs> I, you get it. So I, I sit there, he comes in, he asks me if I'm doing okay. I say, I'm fine. He asks me about the chair I'm sitting in. He's like, is the chair comfortable? And I'm like, yeah, it's, it's pretty comfortable. And he goes, yeah, it's a, it's a new chair. And eventually we get down to business. And he says, do you know why I brought you in here today? And I say, no. And then he unfolds the newspaper that contains this illustration. And he goes, did you make this? I said, yes. And he asks me, do you see anything wrong with this? I say, oh, did I use numbers of actual players on each football team? Because I swear I just picked random numbers. And he goes, no, no, it's not the numbers. I say, okay, hmm. Does one of the does one of the players like resemble another real life player? Well, what is this? I caught an empty can. <sighs> okay. All right. Well, that, that's good. I'm gonna keep fishing. So I asked him, does this look, does it resemble an actual player on the team? And he goes, you're, you're getting warmer. Then like three other people walk into the room, one of them being the football coach. And they start asking me a couple questions. Like, do you, did you, did you draw this? Did you take into consideration feelings of other players when you drew this? And I'm like, I, I, I guess not. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to offend anybody. And finally it clicks and I say, oh, People interpreted this as a racist drawing, and they go, there you go, that is the issue. We just need you to <laughs> write an apology letter and explain that you didn't intend to offend anybody and that, you know, <laughs> you're not a racist. So I wrote an apology letter, uh, they accepted it. I just said, hey, I just, it's pen and ink, I didn't know any better, I was trying to differentiate the players, I wasn't trying to make it look like a black versus white scenario. And I delivered the apology letter to the principal's office. And that was kind of the end of it. I, the, the other weird thing was uh, one of... So they, they were trying to find me. That's why my teacher had to call me. Ah, Yoshiller! 
I take it you found a suitable spot for Blathers to set up, hmm? I did. I'll continue, continue the story in a moment. I knew I could count on you. I'll let Blathers know that he can move in as soon as he wants. By the way, Yo Schiller, you were saving up Nook Miles, right? There's no rush to pay me back, of course. I'm just excited to see the program in action. I've got a few tips for racking up the old Nook Mile, so don't hesitate to ask me if you need a little advice. Great. Thank you. So, they were trying to find me. I wasn't in the classroom because I was out helping someone do an interview because that's what journalism is. And I eventually got to the point where they didn't know where I was, so that's why the teacher had to call me. But they were talking over their walkie-talkies, like they were trying to contact staff, whether it was janitors or people that go around and fix the computers in the school. Just whoever has these walkie-talkies, and they were like, can you, can you find Bradley Shapiro and tell him to go to the principal's office? And I guess one of the employees at the school, like, knew I was a good student and was like, why do you need Bradley to go to the principal's office? What could he have possibly done? So he saw me later on in the day and told me that. He was like, what did you do? That warrants you going to the principal's office. And I told him I, I made it a drawing that was a pe uh, offensive and I didn't, I didn't think about it at the time. <laughs> so I wonder if from this day onward he actually thinks I became a bad student. He's like, you drew an offensive drawing and got sent to the principal's office? Ugh. Or if he actually did have my back and was like, I don't, I don't think Bradley's the type of person that would need to go to the principal's office. But what do I know? That was... Fish didn't even stay on that one. That was just the time I went to the principal's office. That was that story. And I told that story so that in case you guys want to hear more stories, or maybe you don't, maybe I did a terrible job explaining that story. If you guys have Q&A or something, I could try to do that at the end of each of these videos. But as it stands, I'm going to go back to looking for tree branches. Like that one. I'm going to look for pebbles. And I'm going to try and make an axe. So, that'll all be nice. All be nice. Okay. Whoa, see, there's a gift there, but it's on the other side of the island, and I would only be able to get it with a slingshot, and even then, it's on the other side of the island. So I can't get that right now, and I don't know how long that's going to stay there, but for the time being, I'll have to leave it alone. Oi. Oi, I say. Hey, another fish. Okay. Do you, don't you want this? No. Okay, you're the last fish I'm fishing today. I'm running out of time for today. Eh. Go get it. Okay. Very good, very good, very good, very good, very good. Hey, this is a smaller one. Yes! I caught an anchovy. Stay away from my pizza. <laughs> but I can't carry anything else. Should I swap it with something? Yeah. Swap it. I think I picked up another weed, right? No, I didn't. Hmm. Oh, I had a slingshot. Or it's a recipe for a slingshot. Okay. Well, shoot. <laughs> I guess we'll we'll let the empty can go for now. All right. Very good. Very very good. And then we'll check in on this place tomorrow and see what this place's deal is. Okay. Well, so Nookster, do I give you these fish still? I'm not. I'm not so certain anymore. Let me check in. Let me see if I can make an axe before the day is over. And then we'll go ahead and call it a day, hmm? Does that sound good? That sounds okay to me. Let me see. And then I wasn't supposed to get a stone. I was supposed to get like a pebble, right? Or maybe I was supposed to get a stone, I don't know. Yeah, I did. Oh, I have, I have plenty. Okay, so let's, let's craft it. Let's do it. So boom, I'm crafting it. Got it. Excellent. I made a flimsy axe! Okay, hang on. So what else can I craft? I just want to see real quick. I wanted to craft... Oh, oh, oh. Log sticks, huh? Well, I don't, I don't really need the rest of these right now. They're not as necessary. Okay. Yeah, this is just categorizing them. Okay, well, that's fine. And then I will... What do I have on me right now? Anchovy wasp. Okay, so what if I gave you the anchovy nook? Can you take that right now? What would you like to talk to me about? I'm all ears. Nope, I can't give them to you anymore. I have to wait for that owl dude to move in. Okay. Do please feel free. Okay. Da -da 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 -da. I have an anchovy and I would like to dispose of it, please. Thank you. Whew. 
All right. Well, what do you say we go ahead and put the fishing rod away? Put that away. I guess I'll eat one of these pears. Oh, I can eat lots of pears, huh? I guess I'm supposed to eat lots of pears. Guys, I'm eating the pears. I'm doing it. All right, I'm gonna eat all these pears. Man, <laughs> I better get super strength because this is not my favorite fruit. Eating the pears. Okay, we are going. Okay, boom. All right, very good. Three more pears, huh? All right, well, I'll get a couple more tree branches. Just in case I need that to craft another object. And I'll go ahead and get this stone as well. Alright, boom. Boom. Maybe we don't have three more pears. Maybe I took all the pears! No! There they are. <laughs> and there's definitely some still sitting on the island, so boom. Huh? My pockets are full already. Oh, that stone? Okay, I guess I don't need the stone then. Get that stone out of here. All right, eating the pears, eating the pears. Okay, so I'll eat, I will eat pear. Thank you. Okay, there, okay. <laughs> going, going, going. And then, no, I don't wanna, darn, I mashed A too quickly. Nope, I mashed Y too quickly. Drop the clump of weeds, pick up the pear, eat the pear. All right. Eat it. Very good. So what happens? I've eaten 10 now. I'm just maxed out. Can I shake the tree harder or something? Can I do something with the rock? No. Can I do something with this rock? It looks different. No. What was the point of me eating all those pears? That was terrible. That was horrible. I don't want to do that ever again. <laughs> I don't ever just want to eat 10 pears ever again. All right. Let's let's. Is that new guy already here? How long does it take for him to get here? Do I have to wait the full day? I believe so. This spot is reserved for Blather's Tent, Nook Inc. Okay, well, I have an axe, but what I should have made was a shovel. What other items do I have on hand? A leaf umbrella, a sling... Learn. So let's learn that. Huh, okay. Sweet! I learned a DIY recipe for a slingshot. Great. And then we'll learn that one too, real quick. And then I have a, th I have a third item in the lower left. Huh, okay, sweet! I learned a DIY recipe for a leaf umbrella. Cool. And then a wooden table mirror. Huh, okay. Sweet, I learned a DIY recipe for a wooden table mirror. Great. Alright. Nook Miles. Let's see. I have, I unlocked something. Or maybe not. Maybe it's just telling me I have more opportunities available to me no I didn't I didn't get any more miles I'm not paying off my first set of nook miles today that'll have to be tomorrow that's for the DIY recipes I can make a slingshot if I have enough hardwood and I have the I can get the hardwood if I use the axe right I chop down the tree yeah so we'll do that so if I do this yes yes getting the hardwood all right, all right, all right, all right. Boom, thank you. No, I didn't. I don't want the clump of weeds now. Drop it. I need, okay. And then can I finally just cut down this tree that's blocking my mailbox? If I just whack it a bunch of times, can I chop the whole thing down? Let's go. Keep going, keep going. It's a flimsy axe, so maybe I can't knock down the tree just yet. How do I relocate the tree then? Ugh. I just wasted so many swings with this axe. It's gonna break any moment now, isn't it? Okay, and some of these are different colors. They still all act as wood? Let me see. No, all hardwood and regular wood. Yeah, I guess that makes sense. Very good. So when do I get an axe that's strong enough to knock the tree down? That's what I want to know. Not today, obviously, but in due time. Okay. Eh. Eh. And then there's three types of wood. We got soft wood. Wood and hardwood. Uh oh. That's that's too many woods, bub. Okay, well let's see if I can make use out of it real quickly before today is over. 
because we are, we are reaching the end, folks. We are reaching the last minute of this video. So, let's see if I can craft something real quickly. Boom. Yes. All right, Nookster, I'm using your workbench one more time. We are gonna get a slingshot and a watering can. All right, that way I'll be all set for tomorrow. So boom, made a slingshot, keep crafting. And we'll get the watering can. All right. The pockets are too full. I need to sell some stuff. All right. Welcome, Yoshiller. How can I help you today? I want to sell. Okay. I am offering a common butterfly for sale. And your... Hmm. I guess a giant clam again. I can get another one of those. I hope. Look at all the finest things you brought in today. Allow me to just a moment. Okay. Da -da -da. For a total of 1,060 bells. Sounds great. Thank you. I hope my swollen eyeball does not psych you out. All right, but I need I need a shovel or something, right? So let's craft. Can I get a shovel yet or no? No, I cannot. Okay, that's fine. Leaf umbrella, hay bed. Then we'll just we'll we'll, we'll go for this. Let's do it. In due time, I will get a shovel. Well, folks, today I wanted to go fishing. I did some fishing. And then I got stung by wasps, and then I caught some bugs, and then I learned that Blathers is going to be moving in. So hopefully he'll be here by tomorrow. I did some stuff today. I guess that's how a lot of these Animal Crossing New Horizons videos are going to go. I will have to end them by saying, yeah, I did some stuff today. Okay, I was trying to end this video. We're ending the video, darn it. I dropped the flowers. That's This game's all about resource management, darn it. And I'm going to learn how to manage my resources. For now, folks, that wraps up this video of Animal Crossing New Horizons, and I'd like to thank you all for watching. I hope to see you all in future videos, and I hope that you enjoyed what I had to offer for today. For now, bye bye humans! Whoosh! Hey, thank you for watching my video all the way to the end. If you want to show your support, one of the best things you can do is leave a comment down below. So if you have anything nice you want to say about the video, or if you have any questions, I'll try to respond to whatever I can at my earliest convenience. Either way, your support means a lot and I really appreciate it. I hope to see you all in the future. Bye-bye!